Where the planets do the hula Spin and shock till you find yourself on Zula Let's take off, we're all ready to roll It's fun to learn with the Zula Patrol Wake up, Gorga, it's time to play Come on, Captain Bula, let's welcome the day Where's that cedar, ready to go? Wizzy and wig are good to go Beakers bubbling, turning blue Mortals making something new Way, way out where the planets do the hula Spin and shot till you find yourself on Zula See your round ball submission control It's fun to learn with the Zula Patrol Way, way out where the planets do the hula Spin and shot till you find yourself on Zula See your round ball submission control It's fun to learn with the Zula Patrol Submitted for your approval, what looks to be an ordinary day in space, but beneath the calm surface of this seemingly peaceful scene, lurks a story so fiendish, so terrifying, that I can't bring myself to tell it. So here's a different one, which is also good, and doesn't scare me. This is great. No, I don't think so. Come on. Order. Now, I think we're all agreed that Dark Truder has been a thorn in our side long enough. I'll say! Sometimes he acts like a real animal! <coughs> Not to mention all the damage he does. He ruins everything! <coughs> and I'm tired of cleaning up all the messes he makes! Zeter's right. We've got to act now, but it won't be easy. Sometimes I wish he'd just go away. Me too! Way off into the solar system! <coughs> Then we're all agreed. Truder is definitely off our holiday card list. Huh? Hey, that sounds like one of the scooters. <laughs> it's a note from Gorga. He says he doesn't want to be a bother anymore. He's gone to live someplace in the solar system. Why would Gorga think he's a bother? Well, there was that incident with my slipper this morning. <laughs> <laughs> but Gorka knows how much he means to us, doesn't he? I don't know, but we're going to find him and bring him back. This is a job for the Zula Patrol. Poor little guy, all alone out there. He must be missing us terribly. <laughs> Here we go. Leaping light years, look at all that stuff in the solar system. We'll never find him. Now, now, Zeta, let's not panic. With a little help from the Multopedia, we should be able to come up with a plan to find Gorga. <laughs> now, the solar system is made up of the sun, the nine planets, asteroids, comets, dust particles, and everything else that orbits or goes around the sun. Kind of like a giant merry-go-round. Except that everything's going around the sun at different speeds. Lucky for us, the planets are all in a particular order. Closest to the sun is Mercury, followed by Venus, Earth, and Mars. They're known as the rocky planets. Then comes Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. They're called the gas giants. The smallest planet and furthest from the sun is Pluto, known as an icy planet. How are we supposed to remember the order? It's easy. Just remember Molto's very easy method just stops us naming planets. I get it. So we can start looking for Gorga on Mercury, the closest planet to the sun. Then continue to search the other planets in order until we've checked all nine. Precisely. Let's get moving. The solar system is a big place. There's no telling what trouble Gorga might get into. Hey, you're welcome to hang with me, little doodling. Now, no worries. Snowboarding is a piece of cake. Okay, let's boogie, because this rock is ready to roll! Some jump, dude! <laughs>
You busted huge air over that gap. Huh? Cool face, Fuzz, dude. Come on, if we hustle, we'll have time to surf the asteroid belt before dinner. Oh. Uh, I get it. Extreme space sports aren't your bag, huh? <laughs> Okay, but anytime you want to shred the gnar on the Martian ice caps, you know where to find me. Uh-huh. We're looking for Gorga, Mercury. We came to you first because, well, you're closest to the sun. You got that right, Bula, my friend. I'm hot stuff. Boiling hot when I'm facing the sun. Freezing cold when I'm not. Want to see me make cupcakes in my craters? Uh, no thanks. We need to look for Gorga. Oh, yeah. Haven't seen them. You got any sprinkles? Well, maybe Zeter's doing better on the second planet from the sun. Patrol ship to Zeter. Have you found Gorga? No sign of him anywhere on Venus, but I do have one thing to report. What's that? The atmospheric pressure here is a lot greater than Earth. I'm getting flattened. Get me out of here! Hang tight, Zeter. We're on our way. Oh, I sure hope Malto's having better luck with the next planet from the sun, Earth. You sure you haven't seen Gorka? Nope, cross my continents. But I got so many living things on me, I might have missed them. Maybe my moon saw him. Oh, sure, I saw him. He was headed in that direction. Or was it that direction? No, no, it was definitely that direction. But you're sure you saw him? Absolutely, positively, definitely, without a doubt. Saw who? Oh. <laughs> You're it! No, you're it! No, you're it! <laughs> <laughs> hey, he's fun! Why don't we take him home with us? Can we keep him, Bob? Can we? Can we, huh? All the other dust particles have pets. Now, kids, remember what happened when you tried to adopt that black hole? We still can't find Grandpa. But you promised we could have a pet! Well... All right! Come on, boy! Let's go home! <laughs> Maybe he belongs to somebody else. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Someone's obviously taken very good care of him. I'm sure they love and miss him very much. I'm sure he loves and misses them, too. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh, we'll never have a pet of our own. Come on, everyone. We might as well go home. Bye, boy. <laughs> Now, now, no one's gonna hurt you. But we can't have you gallivanting around the solar system, now can we? Oh, you're not getting a thing out of me, see? I'm Mars, fourth planet from the sun. I know my rights. I'll never squeal, never. But we just wondered if you've seen Gorga. Uh, calm down, Mars. You'll melt your ice caps. Don't pay any attention to that red ball of rusty. Besides, if Gorga was looking for a new home, he'd most likely want to move to me. Oh, yeah, sure. Nothing says home like a bloated ball of gas. <laughs> Actually, I'm mostly liquid with some gas, but I'm still the biggest planet in the solar system. Uh, and uh, I have many moons, right, Saturn? Right. I believe the official count is oodles. If we do see Gorka, I'll be sure to give you a ring. Get it? Give you a ring? <laughs> well, that rules out the fourth planet Mars, fifth planet Jupiter, and sixth planet Saturn. How'd you remember that? Easy! Moto's very easy method just starts us naming planets. No sign of them on Uranus. But why would Gorga even want to go to that planet? It rotates sideways. The Neptune's winds would have blown him away. I checked Pluto, but there's nothing there but ice and rock. That means we've searched all nine planets of the solar system from Mercury to Pluto. Not to mention a lot of the moons, asteroids, comets, and dust particles traveling around the sun, too. There's no place in the solar system we haven't looked. Except for one, the intergalactic pet catcher. All right, he picks up lost pets. But he has one of the fastest ships in the universe. No one's ever been able to catch up to him before. Hmm. We're going as fast as we can! Oh, but it's not fast enough! Hey, look! He's slowing down! 
no one's ever come even close to catching me before. So I figured it must have been something pretty important. We're looking for Gorga, a member of our patrol. We think you might have picked him up. There's a pet in there, all right. But it's not him. <sighs> Looks like we lost him forever. I wish I could tell Gorga how much I care about him. We all miss him, Bula. Yeah. The Zula Patrol just isn't the Zula Patrol without him. <laughs> this is all I have left to remember him. <laughs> Not now, Gorga. <gasps> Gorga! Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, am I glad to see you. <laughs> Gorga, where do you come from? He was in the front seat with me. The little guy knew so much about the solar system, he helped me navigate. <laughs> Pet, mister? Well, Gorga here had a great idea. <laughs> you know, when it comes right down to it, there's nothing like the place we call home and the aliens we call family. As long as we stick together, there's nothing we can't do. <laughs> Except maybe this. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's go home. To all appearances, just an alien and his pet heading home covered with drool in a small town called Space. Okay, everyone. It's time for our Malto moment. The solar system is made up of the sun and everything that travels around the sun, including planets, asteroids, comets, and dust particles. Do you know how many planets there are in the solar system? Uh, 72! <laughs> Not quite. Do you know? That's right! There are nine planets in the solar system. That was going to be my next guess. Do you remember the order of the planets starting from the sun? I do! I do! Closest to the sun is Mercury, followed by Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and finally Pluto. <laughs> well, see you next time. 